A Jeff Fisher-led team, always well coached. Greg Williams, defensive coach, that's an impressive win. Any win in the NFL is tough to get. Any win on the road, especially tough to get. But looking ahead at their schedule, a must win tonight or today, and they, they got it done. A good team has to beat a bad team to be successful. You're right. right. Is it possible that this offense is now their most important person is Cordero Patterson? Well, I don't even think he's our best wide receiver, personally. Really? I think Greg Jennings is. I'm a little biased because Greg's a friend of mine. I <laughs> trained with him. But uh, I think he's an elite kick returner. He's an elite athlete. But when I, from a wide receiver perspective, I look at X's and O's, how you run routes, he's not there yet. He's an important piece, but I think the most important piece of the Vikings is Mike Zimmer. I think that kit was great. So you're biased against Jennings. What do you think? Well, the, the new thing in the NFL this year is the jet sweep. Last mm -hmm. year was the read option, year before, or a couple years wild prior cat. was Wildcat. Yeah. It, it, it'll take another, you know, a few weeks before teams get adjusted to it. Once they do, I think that'll minimize his effectiveness on the field. And if you just play him as a wide receiver, I don't think he's that dynamic of player. Whereas Greg Jennings, Kyle Rudolph, Adrian Peterson obviously are your key components. How excited should we be for Teddy time? Well, I think I, I would give him an A. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's you'd have to be really nitpicky to give him anything below that. Uh, they were smart with the game plan. They kept it simple. Uh, they didn't allow him to really throw downfield. Uh, I don't know if that's something he just doesn't do as well, but they kept a lot of underneath. Uh, they utilized Jarius Wright, who which you know they. I don't think Atlanta really schemed for. Mm -hmm. And anytime they brought pressure, you saw Teddy making checks. And I think it was automatic check to a quick wide receiver screen. They got the ball out of his hands fast. And, uh, you know, it was a smart game plan. And, and Teddy, he moved around in the pocket really well, which I was nice to see. 190 yards yeah. in the first half rushing um, with backups, with your best blocking uh, lineman out of the game. <clears throat> Yeah, hats off to Norv Turner. I mean, I think that's one of the most underrated things that doesn't get talked about is the fact that both him and Mike Zimmer are phenomenal uh, offense and defensive minds, respectively. I would say Hodges and Robinson were the two players of the game for me. Hodges stepped in for Greenway, and you didn't skip a beat. Granny maybe only ended with three or four tackles, but he was a playmaker. He was in the backfield. And then Robin, Josh Robinson, you know, just stepped up. They said, hey, guard Roddy, Roddy White and, you know, you're on him all game, and yeah. he shut Roddy down. 